we have something, I'm nervous about what's about to happen. Uh, we have something a bit different today to start the show um, because my producers like to just mess with me, um, which is love, right? Um, and because we're all fans of the old Rosie O'Donnell show, I love Rosie's show. Um, we're trying, yeah, woo! Um, we are trying something new. This is called. New phone. New phone. Who this? <laughs> New phone who it is, that's funny. Um, the rules are, and while well, we're learning these together, because I'm reading this from the prompter, like Ron Burgundy, uh, because I have no idea what's about to happen. So rules are, someone is about to call in, and without looking, I'll have to guess who it is in, in four questions or less. What? Okay. Oh, and there's the call. Okay, there's the call. Oh, hello? Hello. Oh, wait, I, can you hear me? I can hear you fine. Wait, are they trying to distract their voice? I'm trying to, I'm trying to, okay. Okay, I'm about to turn around and in a moment we'll reveal your face to the audience and people at home. Uh, then I'll have four questions to guess who you are. Here we go, okay. Um, okay, Joe, um, you can reveal our secret caller to the audience because I can't see, so. <laughs> Very excited. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, everyone is very excited. Okay. Okay, are you, I mean, it's this show. Are you an actor? What a dumb question. <laughs> you used to ask me that. Oh, wait. No. I think that sounds like someone I know, but I don't know if that, okay. Okay, then you're a musician. Are you a musician? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that sounds about right. Mm. That was Beetlejuice. <laughs> <That> was... <laughs> okay, at first I thought it was Nile Horn, and then I was like, no, wait, it's like not, because I thought I heard an accent, but like I didn't. Um, okay. Uh, I mean, so then that leads me to leave, but are they maybe like being a kid? Oh, are you, were you, were you Beetlejuice? No, I've never been Beetlejuice, never will be. Never will be. Um, oh my God. I, I know, okay, they, they, they said musician. Hold on, I have one more question, so hold on. I'm s I know, a musician, yes. Who kind of sounds Irish, like, but also British. Like, I'm like, I, so I'm like, I don't know, like, Bana, I'm like, wait, okay, let's, okay. Okay, last question. Um, this was really no prep for this, so. Um, okay. Um, are you, I don't have a question. How do you not, how do you attempt this with one question? Um, uh, are, are, Would you like me to give you a hint? Now, now it sounded like a completely different accent. Okay, <laughs> yes, I would like a hint. In my nickname, they call me Mr. Yearwood. Oh! <laughs> You did such a great job at accents. <laughs> That's great. Oh my God. Yeah. I, I, was, I was like, what? Oh my God, hello. Oh my God. I'm so glad I'm on this end and not on that end. Oh that my seems, God. That Can seems horrible. Can I tell you, they didn't tell me I was gonna have to come up with the questions until just now. And I was like, I was what? And, and I was like, what question? And then you said it like Beetlejuice. And so I was like, and then Irish at one point, I feel like, and then British. And then I was like, you're American. I was like, anyway, so what are you doing here? <laughs> I am gonna ask a favor from a neighbor. If uh, you don't mind, we announced that we are going to do a residency in Las Vegas at ah! And we wanted to share it with you. So excited, wait, so you, I'm so excited about that. Wait, you have a new box set as well, right? 
Yeah, well, you know, as, as we put these tickets on uh, for Christmas presents, and anytime you get tickets for Christmas presents, you kind of sit there with them and nothing really to open. So what the, what the guys at Caesars wanted to do, which I thought was pretty cool, was put together a box set solely for Caesars. It's the only place you can get it. You I don't have to get that. tickets to get it. It can be like a retail store. You can just uh, kind of get them online and then get it, or you can get it with your tickets either way. What I love about this is you talk about live, 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 which Caesars is going to be. This is going to be every kind of different version of live that we have. Um, what's but, the format of the show? What's, what's different about this one? So you remember the one-man show? It's just me and a guitar. This yeah. is called Garth Plus One. Okay, so this is what's cool. We're taking the whole band with us, but the whole band sits with the audience. And if you just want to pull up a fiddle player for a song, fiddle player just comes up. Oh. If you just want to pull up percussion and background vocals for the river, that's all you do. Or if you want to bring the whole band up for a call in Baton Rouge or friends in low places, then you get to do the muscle thing. And it's uh, <gasps> so what I'm going to love about this is it's going to be 8,000 shows in two hours. And uh, that's that's Vegas. That's Garth. And that sounds like a lot of fun to me. It's a whole hell of a lot of fun. I'm so excited. Oh, my That'd gosh. I love seeing you. I've seen you do huge shows. I've seen you do intimate things. It's incredible that you're capable of both and killing it in every arena that you're in and every setting. I'm no BS. I'm so excited about coming to see it. Uh, Garth Brooks is heading to Vegas in 2023, everybody. Go to Ticketmaster.com backslash Garth Vegas to register for tickets and order Garth's new CD box set if you're smart.